That's why I get my exercise height. It's for a phone. And let's face it, obesity has become a huge problem. <laughs> and for geeks like me with a bad sense of humor, it's hard to get us away from our computers, but we found some healthy products with a heavy tech factor here today to put me into shape is Michelle Gagnon. Gagnon? Yes, Gagnon. Perfect. Ooh. And she's a personal trainer and founder of Infinity Personal Training in San Francisco. And, and are you going to be my personal trainer now? Uh, I think I might be. It depends on how you do today. <sighs> Uh, Pressure's hopefully, on. Hopefully I'll do okay. I, seriously, I need. I really need to like be more healthy, like in the physical world. Because all I do is type all day. I sit down and I type. Yeah, it doesn't count as exercise. It doesn't. No, probably oh, not. Darn it. Well, see, I, I, I'm thinking of personal trainer because I don't want to end up like with one half of me like lopsided, you know, and like walking around real weird because I did the wrong thing. Right, and that happens all the time. Does it? Oh, it's tragic. God, I was afraid so. Well, <laughs> let's start out by looking at the pedometer. I've been wearing all show, actually all day, and let's see what we have here. If I can. If you gotta, you gotta be smarter than the pedometer. If I can get it, oh, there we go, there we go. And it looks like I have stepped that many times. Of course, I shook it a few times too. So uh, that's kind of cheating, but well, let it count. Now this number, what does this mean to me? What, what kind of number should I be shooting for? Uh, ideally, you want to go for 10,000 steps a day, which is about five and a quarter miles. Okay. So yeah, they, right now you're at what? Uh, 1,600. 1, yeah. 1,600 is not bad. It's a good start. You've been wearing it for about what a half an hour now? Uh, ish. Okay, you might have to do some more walking in place. But. Well, I think half of it was my coffee shakes. <laughs> I think it was just, just like just going like insane. But this is good to, to monitor your progress so that you don't have to necessarily think about it. Exactly. And exercise is cumulative, so you don't have to do one straight half an hour. It all adds up, and that's the theory behind wearing this. All right. Well, what if, I mean, like, like myself here, when I walk, it's usually very fast and it's uphill, downhill in San Francisco. But what if someone wasn't motivated to do it on their own? Is there something they could do? Well, you know, there's a website called walkablock.com that you can sign into. It helps you find other people who are walking in your area. And they also have you enter every Sunday night how much exercise you've been doing all week. And they add up everyone's results. And they do things like walk across America or walk across Africa where they give you information on um, different places you would be going through if you were doing this virtual That's walk. That's kind of cool. Kind of like the mall walkers. Kind of like the mall walkers. Yeah. I've seen, you know, they're usually, they, I think to be a mall walker, you have to be at least 94 years old. <laughs> so it's, or it's something like AARP, you have to have a card or something like that. Anyway, so that, that's, just, that's just for watching stuff, but uh, we've obviously got some equipment here. We do. Coming in, I, I, was, I was cycling on this particular unit, which is connected to a computer. And this would be perfect maybe for, for gamers, correct? It is, actually. You can play video games. Um, just by pedaling instead of using a joystick. All right, I think I'll give it a shot then. Ooh, we got we got it up here right now. Now, yeah. is this the only game that we could play with this particular device? This is actually a simulated environment. So you're doing a ride. I think that this is in if Northern California. Uh oh. Wow! Tell you, it just Look at me! It doesn't Look. feel like you're going anywhere, does it? No, it doesn't. But I feel like I'm going somewhere. I think I'm. I think <laughs> my heart rate is just. Yeah, it's definitely. Getting up there, isn't uh -huh. it? Uh-huh. Yeah, well, I can feel theoretically, it. Theoretically, you would actually be Is moving. it plugged in? Hang on. Okay. Here's a note to people. Uh. If you want it to work, <laughs> it's got to be plugged in. <laughs> so, let's plug it in. I'm having some technical difficulties. Yeah. Let's see if we, can, if we can plug it in here. I think maybe. Hey, Dan. Come here. You want to plug us in? Get it backwards. That's right. It goes this way. This is a pretty good workout right here. I'm breaking a sweat. I know. <laughs> That's for sure. All right. All right. So All right. now, in theory, I should be able to. In theory, the bike should stay. Hey! There we there go. We go. Woo! <laughs> And that's hell no Focus wow, the chair shaking is working so hard. I know. It's a comfy chair, though. <laughs> the comfy chair. The comfy so, chair. Theoretically, you should be able to do this even at your computer, sitting there working during the day. Whoa, really? Like, yeah. so you can be typing along and doing this? Oh, my God. I am working. Good. I sweat. It's like patting your head and rubbing your stomach. This, is, is, is there resistance going on on this thing? Can you just feel... can change the resistance. There's a knob in the front that you, you can see it right down there. You can adjust that. You know, that's their nickname for me? The knob in the, the front? The knob in the front. That's right. We set it on the easiest setting for oh, you. Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. <laughs>
kind of clunky. Yeah, it's, I think one of the, the only problems with the Sim Cycle is they went for uh, lightweight and easy to store, so it, it can kind of slip around a little yeah. bit. You have to have it brace against something to be really effective. So can I, can I put any game in here then, or just like... You know, they say that there's a whole variety of different Sony and uh, Xbox games that can work with this. There's a NASCAR game. I know that Quake works. Um, so, you know, it kind of depends. Quake. Quake. Oh, my God. <laughs> That's seriously cool. I mean, it's something like me, you know, has got a short attention span. In fact, let's move along to the next product. I'm going to let you do this one. All this right. is that, that video game craze that I've seen kids in the arcades, the Dance oh. Dance Revolution. Yeah, the kids go crazy for this one. Why? You know, it's really entertaining. <laughs> I have to say, I'm a little hooked on it myself. Yeah, because you're, you're a personal trainer. I mean, yeah. these products, would this be something that you would use or recommend for your clients? I use this all the time. I've got one of these at home. I actually love it. I think it's the new karaoke. So how good are you? You know, I'm, I'm pretty mediocre. I should be a <laughs> lot better considering. It's okay. Pretty mediocre. We're not going to remember that one. <laughs> Ooh, and they got a calorie burning mode? They do. They track your calories. They compare it to how much you would burn, say, swimming or running. So it gives you really? some sort of a barometer to work against. A barometer? A barometer. Wow. I'm pulling out the big words today. That's almost as good as pedometer. <laughs> Let me turn this a teeny bit. Okay. Yeah, get comfortable. Know, Whatever you got to do. I'm going to be all thrown off. I want to make sure I've got my game on. So as the arrows go up, you see it moving up the screen. Yeah. And it hits that. Oh, oh you got I'm already getting booed. This isn't good. It's okay, because even if you mess it up, you're, you know, you're still burning calories. Look at those. Hey, exactly. you already burned. Is that 147? No, no, I can't I be. think that might just be one, actually. Be, but not even one. <laughs> Is there a way to, like, you know, well? Wow, you hey, look at that. Cool. And then it's like motivation. It is motivation. Yeah. It's, you know, distract you from the fact that you're doing a sort of load of the dance workout. Yeah, because like I had, my, my parents used to motivate. Move it, fatty! <laughs> that's, that's all I got. Positive reinforcement. Well, I was junkie as a kid, so they threw me in the pool. Be free, Shamu! <laughs> Didn't really work. Oh, both feet. Awesome, awesome! What'd he say? Awesome? He said awesome. Right. Yeah, the game cheers you or mocks you, depending on how you do it. So it's kind of like a wife. Yeah, kind yeah, of. Gotcha. I'm familiar with that little analogy there. So, so this is something that you know you're, you can keep you can keep I'm, doing that as yeah, long as you I want. Yeah, I mean, I'm I'm really I'm doing pretty well. I think this might be my best game yet. Really? Yeah. So far, my score is really getting up there. You yeah. know, seriously, I'm watching you and I'm working up a sweat. Look at this. <laughs> I'm serious. This is crazy. Well, thank you so much, Michelle. No problem. For doing this and and uh, I'm serious. I, I, I we should talk because I really need a personal trainer okay. like, to help okay, me like, get going and stuff. I really do. Don't I? Look. I don't know. You're hiding it with your M&M sweatshirt there. It's you look like you're working. I out, look like though. a peanut I mean, M&M. That's going. for sure. <laughs> anyway, yeah, true. Anyway, Michelle, yes. thank you so much for coming in. And of Great course, we're gonna track my progress as time rolls on because I hopefully will be. Oh, there you are. Hey, how you doing? It's the beauty of robotic cameras. No one's controlling the camera, and it moves on its own. It's kind of scary that way, Michelle. Anyway, we got the reviews for these products over on our website, TechTV.com/slash/call for help. Oh!